Good morning, guys. Good morning. Across North Texas, food banks and pantries are staying busy. There you go. Even more now with the holidays quickly approaching. We're feeling the pinch. In Pleasant Grove, the staff at Inspired Vision Compassion Center is seeing a spike in need. When you're talking the kind of inflation we've got going right now, people are scared. Dr. Tijan White says the center is averaging about 100 new families stopping by here each day. I think people are concerned with gas prices going up, food prices going up. And like many nonprofits, supply chain issues and inflation are among challenges charitable organizations are dealing with behind the scenes. Here in South Dallas, hundreds of people lined up for the SM Wright Foundation's Thanksgiving celebration on Thursday. Neighbors said turkey, ham, or duck were among options in grocery donations here. But citywide, some organizations, even council members, are canceling annual turkey giveaways. They say due to sponsors backing out over limited supply this year. The need is there, but they don't have it. They just don't have it. In Oak Cliff this week, large crowds showed up at 4 Oak Cliff's Heart of Harvest food distribution event. Community partners helped donate turkeys and hams. When those ran out, gift cards were offered for groceries. I feel uh, blessed to be able to provide resources to our people. Oak Cliff Veggie Project's another nonprofit seeing challenges with price increases, though it's finding ways to continue donating fresh produce to the community. And we're going to do everything we can by any means necessary to provide for our people. While local nonprofits are concerned, their leaders remain optimistic. In Dallas, I'm Damon Fernandez.